if you're an inspiring rapper, don't copy what these other rappers are doing. Copy what Kendrick Lamar is doing, bro. He is smart. How many albums does Kendrick Lamar have compared to NBA Youngboy? Let me know in the comments. How many albums does he have compared to NBA Youngboy? NBA Youngboy did like 19 albums in the last year. Kendrick Lamar did like five or six in the last, his whole career. Like 12, 13 years. There's a way an artist can stay relevant and, and maintain like his legendariness. Kendrick Lamar, I don't, I don't remember when his last album, when um, Big Stepper uh, dropped. I want to say it dropped like in summertime, May, June, July. He's not like these rappers who just throw all their videos out. We back to back to back to back. No, bro. You got to let your shit marinate, bro. You, you got to make people love your shit where, okay, I did the N95 video. Okay, cool. A month or two later, I did another one. A month or two later, I did Count Me Out. Bro, that's how you gotta do, bro. You can't, you can't make this microwave music. And I don't want to keep, I want to do this this long rant, but I just gotta say this, bro. This is this is true legendary rapper, bro. He's smart, bro. He's not like most of these dumb rappers, bro. He's he's putting everything out like he's he's gonna he's gonna stretch this out. Why do you think? I think I want to say the the last album, damn, like broke records on uh, longest charting album. I think either him or Drake got it. Longest charting album because he spreads it and Dan only had 10 songs on it. Dan only had 10 songs and it was like the longest. I think it, it was like for four or five years it charted. It's some crazy um, record he got. And he going to do the same thing with this, bro. Because if you haven't heard the album, oh, he, he dropped Count Me Out. Now I want to go back and listen to the rest of the album. Or maybe I heard the album and I, I love this song. Makes me want to go back and listen to it again. Think, bro. God, think. These rappers need to start thinking. But anyways, bro, we got K-Dot. Count me out. Uh, I don't know. I'm, I, I listened to the album, but I'm not good with names. But the, the, this, the, the name, like, popped out to me, so I'm pretty sure I heard the song. So let's go. You know his albums be dope, bro. Monumental videos. Kendrick. Kendrick. Did you hear that, Kendrick? What, the uh, ring? Yes. Um, my apologies. I thought my time was up. No, we can continue if you like. Bro, why? <laughs> why I thought she was about to be some creepy old lady, like, like, like from a scary movie. <laughs> I was kind of shook. Like, I kind of like, had my eyes closed because I thought it was about to be some some creepy Halloween type thing. Um, my apologies. I thought my time was up. No, we can continue if you like. So, what did you say to the to the lady in the parking structure? You took my damn parking spot. I told her I didn't take your damn parking, parking spot. spot. And how did that make you feel? Have you actually? That way? Uh, you see this in movies all the time. Have you actually seen people actually fight over a parking spot? I never witnessed people actually fighting over a parking spot. I know if I cut someone off and do that, bro, I always I, I look down the whole time. And I'll, I'll sit in my, I'll sit in my car and be on the phone until they, they leave. I'll look to the rear view. <laughs> like, like you, you know if you're wrong, bro. I never got approached by cutting someone off though, in the parking spot. I felt decent. Oh, how come? Because I did take a parking spot. <laughs> 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 you. No. This is anger management. <laughs> You texted me at two o'clock in the morning. You know what time it was. I feel like I'm fallen. Why do you feel that way? Life. Well, he needs to be an actor, bro. One of these 
these lies, I'ma make these right with the wrongs I done. That's when I unite with the father, son, till then I fight. Rain on me, put the blame on me. Got guilt, got hurt, got shame on me. Got six magazines that's aimed at me. Done every magazine was fame to me. It's a game to me. Man. I got six magazines that's aimed at me. You're thinking of magazines. No, he's talking about magazines. Y'all know. Y'all, <laughs> I like, well, this song's kind of short. I like that, bro. We got six magazines that's aimed at me. Done every magazine was fame to me. It's a game to me. Man. With a bedroom mat. Sleep, I ain't never had a fast with that. What's fair when the hearts and the words don't reach? What's fair when the money don't take things back? It's rare when somebody take your dreams back. I care too much. Wanna share too much. In my head too much. I shut down too. I ain't there too much. I'm a complex soul. They layered me up. Then broke me down. The morality's dust. I lack in trust. This time around, I trust myself. Please everybody else but myself. All else fails. I was myself. Out done fear. Out done myself. This year you better warn yourself. Mass on a bitch. Hold on, hold on. Sometimes it's I'll be slow. Well he said he only trusts himself and the contrast because he's not with TDE no more, right? Or this was the last album with TDE. Did they screw him over? Like what's the whole thing with him and TDE why he's not going like it seemed like they was always focused on him and schoolboy Q. Like maybe maybe just Kendrick, really. Um why is he leaving TDE? Trust myself, out done fear, out done myself. This year you better warn yourself. Mass on the babies, mass on the hotware, mass in the neighborhood stores you shop, but a mask won't hide who you are inside. Look around the realities carved in lies. Wipe my ego, dodge my pride. Look myself in the mirror, Emily Phil, ain't seen nothing scarier. I fought like a pit bull terrier, blood I shed, could fill up aquariums. Tell all my angels carry them. Every emotion been deprived. Even my strong points couldn't survive. If I didn't learn to love myself, forgive myself a hundred times, dog. I love when you count me out. I love when you count me out. I love when you count me. I love when you count me out. Bro, he make timeless music. I know I asked this question a million times. You got like 50 Cent, uh, Get Rich, Die Trying. You got uh, like Illmatic, Nas, Illmatic. I'm trying to think of like classic, classic albums. Uh, maybe Lil Wayne Carter or Carter 3, whichever one you want to choose. Uh, pick your poison. Um, these albums are going, these artists we're going to listen to 20 years from now and another 20 years. Not that many new artists. I'm not even going to say new, bro, within the last 10 years. You're going to really listen to for years to come. But I think Kendrick, J. Cole, Drake are like the few that you're going to you're gonna listen to with your grandkids. Like I, I really believe like that. And I'm not even a big Kendrick fan like that, bro. But I respect his craft. I'm stout. I love when you count me out. I love when you count me out. I love when you count me out. Angel, he got his angel on his side at all times. I love that. I like that, bro. It's subtle. It's not too much. He's not making it long and making it too long, bro. He's just getting straight to the message, bro. He always, you, you want to count me out, bro, but I always got my angel on my side, bro.